I'm Anil Kumar. This video is for my student, Chevy. Now, let's understand how to round a four-digit number. We have five numbers here and we'll round them to the nearest thousand. So the question for you is, round to the nearest thousand. The numbers are 5232, and 1255. Five. You can pause the video, copy these numbers and try to round them to 1000. Now let us understand first, rounding to 1000 means what? Let's read the numbers once again. The first number here is 5232. So it is 5000. When we round this number to nearest 1000, we could round this number to either 5000, that is the lower side, or on the higher side, 6000. Do you get an idea? 5232 is between 5000 and 6000. And therefore, we can round it to either 5000 or 6000. So that is the first step. You need to understand what are possible solutions or what are possible answers. Now, we have to check which one is correct. Should I round 5232 to 5000 or to 6000? Well, for that, we are rounding to 1000. We'll check number at 100 place. So we need to check hundreds place, right? Hundreds place. Now, in our case, hundreds case is 2. So should we round lower or higher? Well, the rule is, when you check hundreds place, if the number is less than 5, that means if the number is 0, 1, 2, 3 or 4, then you round lower. Is that okay? Then you round lower. And if the number is 5, 6, 7, 8 or 9, then you round higher. Correct? higher okay so that is that is the rule for us so let's with check with this rule what should be the correct answer now number in hundreds place so that is the number in hundreds place let me write down this as hundreds two two is lower than five and therefore we will select the lower number and therefore the answer is in this case 5000 you said do you get the idea so what we get here is 5000 as the correct answer now let's do the next one so first thing is let's read the number it is 1767 it comes between 2000 which are 1000 it is higher than 1000 right so three zeros and 2000 right so 1767 is between 1000 and 2000. When you check the number at hundreds place, you see number 7. Now 7 is higher and therefore we will round this to the higher number 2000. Do you get the idea? So 1767 is rounded to 2000 since in hundreds place we have a number which is 5 or more higher, right? So higher. Let's do the next one. In this case, the number is 2550. 2550 is between 2000 and 3000, correct? Check the number in hundreds place. It is 5, that means 5 or more. So, we should be rounding it to the higher number, which is 3000. So, the correct answer is 3000 for us. Let's get to the next one. This one is kind of tricky. Okay, so 3,962 is between 3,000 and 4,000, correct? 3,962 is between 3,000 and 4,000. What is the number in hundreds place? It is 9. Higher, right? So we'll round higher. Higher means 4,000 is the answer. Do you get it? Last one for us. You should do it correctly. 1,255. 
1255 is between 1000 and 2000. Check the number in hundreds place, it is number 2. Since number 2 is on the lower side of 5, we will round this to 1000. Do you get the idea? So that is how rounding is done. So let us write down all the answers. 5232 rounds to 5000. Since hundreds place has 2 in it, which is less than 5. 1767 rounds to 2000. Since in hundreds place we have a number which is 5 or more, so it is rounded higher. 2550 will round to 3000 since the number in hundreds place is 5. The number 3962 is closer to 4000 and therefore it is rounded to 4000. 1255, 2 is in hundreds place which is on the lower side of 5 so that rounds to the lower 1000, 1000. That is how rounding should be done. So the idea here is whenever we are rounding to thousands we need to do two things. First thing is check possible solutions, right? So check possible answer, right? So answer could be in our case, first case 5000 or 6000. So that is the first step and the second step is check hundreds position. We say hundreds place value. Is that okay? So we checked hundreds place value. If it is 5 or more, round higher. If it is less than 5, round lower. So that becomes the key to round four digit numbers or for that matter any digit numbers to thousands. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.